All right, in this video, we're, I'm going to show you how to, to do the bullet style light box effect pop-up window. This is a uh, style that's really, really cool. You can uh, create text links, bullet style text links, and you can obviously, you can change the color of the font, the size of the font. You can customize the, the bullet image. Uh, this is the default image that comes with this. You can manually change the bullet image. You can change the hover. See, when I hover, there's a color. You can change that. But look what happens when I click on it. This is great for membership sites or showing off a product. And you see when I click on that, it has a nice light box uh, pop-up effect. You can add a control bar there. You can add a logo. You can add your, you know, your um, your title tag right here, uh, whatever. It's the player, and you can change the color of the border and everything. And you can change the width of the border and so forth and I can click on the X button and I'll show you how easy this is to set up. This is the back end right here and this is for the self-hosted videos only. This is not for YouTube or Vimeo, it's for self-hosted videos only. And all I did, uh, you'll see that I have a number of videos in here right now. There is, uh, there's how many, two, four, there's six videos that I have. And all you need to do is click on, it says enable pop-up with text links. You wanna make sure that's checked on. And you want to put in your WebM, you want to put in your MP4, there's a flash backup, put your MP4 in there, there's a splash image that I, that I put in there. Um, and so now you don't need a splash image because when it pops up, you can have it play. But I have a splash image because uh, it's mine's not on autoplay, which is probably the best. Uh, here is a video title. So video title is a demo test. Uh, you can see that here's the text link, video one. This is the demo video to show off the feature, okay? So if I go right here, let me, let me click on video one. This is the demo video to show off the feature. So if I click on there, you see, there it is. See that? Very, very cool. And so if I come back uh, again, and I can come back down, and when I, when I select the pop-up for the bullet text, it says right here, this section will be activated when you select that option up here. So let me, let me go through that again. Let me come up. When this is enabled, this section down here will show up. This section right here. Text link pop-up options. So I can change the font size right here. The default is what it is. I can change the link. There's a link color. These are hover color. Um, there's a text link bullet URL. This is if I'm going to add a custom bullet image right here. If I want to change the bullet image, I can put the URL right there. Can we come back? And I put the URL, the full URL right there of the different image. And that's the obsolete URL. So it would be, you know, it would be HTTP and so forth. Here I can change the, the padding uh, between the text and the bullet image. The default is 30. So for example, if I put a different uh, if I customize my image and the text is too far or the text is too close, I can cha change the padding between the image and the text uh, with the padding in the admin right here. Okay, right there. Here is the pop-up width. You know, okay, it's so uh, 720. So if I click on this video, this is going to be 720. Okay, 720 wide. Uh, you'll see that it has a pop-up border color is white as a little color picker and the pop-up border width is 15. Now you want to stay over uh, 10 for sure. I would go around 15 because if you start going less than 10 you run into problems that we found. Um, the border radius you can have it on or off. The border radius puts a little bit of a curve on the border. Okay and you can in embed this as well and so forth. All right. Um, you can see it now that, uh, what am I gonna do here? I'm gonna change the control bar. So instead of hiding the control bar, I'm gonna put the control bar on. And there's a branding text, it's gonna be maximum. And I can customize the branding text. And I'm going to update this, okay? So I'm gonna update this, go to the page here, let me refresh. And now that it's refreshed, I'm going to show that now it's gonna have the control bar when I pop that up. There it is there, you see that? There's a Maxima logo. So very cool, it's a very cool effect. Great for a membership training, a video series, and so forth. 
And what I do, I usually put the, um, on my training courses, I usually put the, how long the video is right inside here. It says, see now this one's 19 seconds and it shows you. That's exactly how I do it in my membership area. So it's 19 seconds and it shows you. So that's a very clean video and it's great for tutorials. Thank you.